So let's go ahead and see what's inside this box. And see what Apple's got for us here. This is a very nice uh, box. Yo, you have the, the watch. Well, I, I, I wish they just called it the watch. And uh, here you have your first view of this beautiful dial. That's how it looks like inside the box. And uh, we are most definitely going to see how this beautiful watch looks like inside in a few. Oh, and that's it. So this is the packaging. <laughs> Pretty beautiful, straightforward, thin case, blue gray trail loop. This is a 49 uh, millimeter watch. And a quick uh, overview of this watch. Oh, you know, you all know that uh, this was released in September uh, this year. It weighs around uh, 61.3 uh, grams. It's it's around uh, again 14.4 uh, millimeter thickness. It has a watch uh, OS9, and we are going to see all that. So this is the band that comes with the watch. It's a trial loop hook and loop closure. Uh, quick overview again uh, nothing unique let's see what's inside here how do we open this yeah remove that open that and you have your quick uh, instructions on how to put in your band to attach the band slide in until you hear click blah 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 i'm going to those details so uh i obviously went with this Color, hoping that was, this would definitely match my uh, tone and texture of my skin. So, yeah, I chose this color. So. This is the band. And this is how it looks like. Well, it looks nice. It feels premium. And yeah, I mean, you all know that the the ultra is a sports watch so uh that being said uh that's the most uh, appropriate band uh, that, that we could use and uh and this is it time to unbox this beautiful piece so, like that. and remove this here yeah so my videos are unscripted i know most people go to scripts i don't do scripts because this is real time and this is how beautiful the watch looks uh, inside the box and i kind of like to grab this yeah here we are the apple watch ultra beautiful beautifully crafted piece so that there is the apple watch ultra we watch OS 9. Uh, apparently, it has a chipset of uh, Apple chip chipset, uh, the Apple 8. Uh, so it has loudspeaker. And this, actually, you don't need your phone. You don't leave your phone at home. Uh, you, you, you have LTE connection. So, if you're going to run and you know you, you, you want to go running and you don't want to carry your phone. This is your watch. So, uh, just what you're seeing in front of you, the, the dimensions of the watch are 49 by 44. Uh, I already mentioned about the weight. It's uh, got a sapphire crystal on the front. And this is ceramic, beautiful ceramic uh, at the back. You can see it there. It's ECM, it's IP6 certified according to Apple. It's 100 meter water resistant, so you can go swimming 100 meters. Uh, you can take a diving up to around 40 meters. I will definitely try that. So it's got all your other things that you need, the ECG certified. Again, um, do not hold this against me. You should have to see a medical doctor uh, even if you're using the app. And the other features and the sensors in this watch 
uh, of course the accelerometer the gyro the heart rate the barometer we got a nose on altimeter the compass uh, you can test your oxygen you test your body temperature the water temperature the depth have the de depth gauge so basically this is your watch if you definitely are a sports person myself i'm lazy but uh, i guess this watch is uh going to motivate me to go ahead and uh, be a sports person so um the sides will have of course the usual upper crown i had the impression that this watch might look smaller but uh i'm surprised that it's uh, actually uh, quite a huge watch and this is my kind of watch i have a big wrist big arm and uh just see how it look like on my arm oh yeah yes yes apple yes this is it this is my daily watch yeah so that being said i really wanted something unique i uh that's why probably i waited all this long to own an apple watch yeah i mean everything else looked the same so yeah you have your loudspeaker here and you have this new orange button on the side and uh we will definitely set it up and come back here uh, that's the Apple logo with the watch starts. So we will set up the watch and fix the, the loops and uh, I will definitely show you the video of uh, how everything looks. And let's see what uh, was remaining in this box. Uh, let's see. Oh, you have the charger here. Beautiful. This is a magnetic charger. So yeah, I'm just gonna break this. This is a USB type C see that grab your watch look at there and boom okay bring iPhone near your Apple watch so yeah uh, my iPhone is near I'm just gonna bring it closer and I will set up my watch and I'll see you in a few minutes and that's it uh, the watch is done setting up Quick uh, overview. This is what we got here. It looks like beautiful display. I'm just gonna go ahead and put in my password. Yeah, there we go. Let's see what we got here. Press to wake, clear or. Yeah, the quick action button. Oh. Let me get to the Okay. So you have all your features here, you have the heart rate monitoring, you have the activity, you know, the it's a quick overview, you have messages and uh, I do not know why it keeps asking for my password but I'm just going to go ahead and put that here on off screen. Yeah, and we we'll see this button on the side. Starts your workout. That's a quick action feature. So you do have outdoor walk, yeah, indoor, outdoor run, indoor run, outdoor cycle, indoor cycle, swimming, open water, multi sport, hiking. You have uh, thousands of uh, physical activities, core training, whatever you want. Yeah. And you can add also workout so that's the, that's the quick feature workout in workout file. okay uh, okay we'll go back here to our crown okay uh, so you have your crown here and this is your uh, uh, watch face Beautiful. Oh, I love it. I have my Toyota up. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and see what was synced here. This is one of my uh, go to apps for my vehicle. Let's open that. Unable to connect to your iPhone. Please launch the app on your device and try again. Okay, I'll see. What's going on here? Once I set that up. Okay, uh, this is pretty much it. Uh, you have settings. You can go settings and have a 
quick look of whatever is going on here you have all those settings uh, there privacy and blah 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 all the details are in there great so yeah and uh, you all know the crown what this is useful so you can increase the light okay I think I love this yeah you can keep it on red that was on display that is one of the beautiful looks I've seen on this watch I love that watch face I love it it is unique and I think this is gonna be my uh, uh, I do have smudges in the watch so I do have smudges on the watch got smudges there yeah so what I like about uh, the watch is actually the size uh, uh, apart from the size the other health features I know they are available on the other series especially the 8 but uh, you know the ECG the high and low heart rate the alerts the fall detection who doesn't like that the emergency SOS the international you know emergency calling the car crash detection I mean that's obviously the highlight the blood oxygen sensor uh, the sleep stage tracking I did try it out a little bit after setting up the watch I didn't like it to be honest uh, my uh, on a GS Pro is better you have a lot of steps to set it up uh, I, I did like it so um, but nonetheless the uh, temperature sensor the it, it's good everything can be accessed in the health app on the iPhone so you, you can go ahead and see the statistics uh, I did find the actual skin temperature readings quite accurate a little bit the apps still uh, standard like every other uh, Apple watch I love the uh, action button it's large it's visible um, and you can customize it to whatever settings you want whatever options you want like the stopwatch the waypoint the back track uh, diving and flashlight so you can customize the, the to whatever shortcuts you want with this uh, action watch here uh, other than that i also like the fact that uh, it has a very large screen you know the large screen is great for readability and um briefly the battery life yeah so uh i did a quick setup i um, charged a little bit and i uh, slept overnight I did wake up when I think still had uh, almost all the battery. The watch faces, uh, they're not that many. Uh, this way finder is a new watch face, I think. Uh, has a compass, in built compass. When you touch it, you get and see the compass. I'm, I'm pretty much new to Apple Watch. I'm gonna learn all that. Uh, what about oh, what the compass is all about and stuff like that. So and uh obviously uh the other thing to like it's uh you can use the watch to swim it's not a dive watch but you can swim with it so apple sees the ultra can handle swimming and scuba diving at depths of up to 40 meters so uh however uh to be able to know your depth you have to submerge the wa the watch underwater you have to be fully underwater to know the depth if you're scuba diving so uh, scuba divers this is your watch and I do love these person I do love the size like I said I do have a uh, great of uh, huge hunt so I love it and uh, in comparison with the the series 8 yeah I think the series 8 has um, uh a smaller screen obviously if you if you look at the the screen size uh, so basically that's it about the uh what i like uh, about the watch so far i do not know uh, uh 
what about other Apple Watch lovers? I'm gonna see about the Ultra. To me, I, I love the big Ultra design. It's bold, speaks for itself. You know, I, you can see that with my uh, Citizen Navihawk. Yeah, and that being said, uh, uh, thanks for watching. I will catch you another video.